Good morning, guys. I was just going to show you the pretty, well, almost sunrise over there. Nice and pink and pretty. I am working on an apple. Lulu has got her flashing, well, her lit light on because it is dark out here no matter how light it looks. We've been out here for a while. So, again, I'm sure it's really pretty over by the water, but I don't know. I just kind of rolled out of bed, threw some clothes on, and decided to get my walk in. Sorry if you can't hear me very well. Number one, my voice is kind of uh, from all the stuff that's in my throat. And then number two, again, on the other side of that wall is a big highway, which is noisy. Um, so it's a beautiful morning. I'm sure the sunrise, like I said, is really pretty over by the water, but I wanted to get this done. My husband looked at me like I was a lunatic, sorry. You have to watch for, sorry, here we go, to watch for um, bicyclists on this path too, and I don't like that either, because I don't always hear them. I thought I'll look back there, <laughs> but um, my husband looked at me like I was crazy when he was asking me, why are you getting out of bed at 6 a.m. in the morning on a weekend? I'm a mother, it doesn't matter whether it's 6 a.m. on the weekend or 6 a.m. on a weekday. The kids are still gonna wanna eat. And they're still gonna wanna, you know, be up. Sorry, she's running around me now. She's crazy. There she goes, back it around. Nope, oh, nope, going that way this time, sorry. When I'm not filming, I make her go around me. Anyways, so, um, I think I'm struggling a little bit with the lack of support from my husband also lately. Um, the whole vegan thing for my family has just like thrown them for a loop and they've all pretty much been making fun of me for it. Which I don't get because I don't eat that much meat. I don't drink milk. It's not that big of a change, you know, a change other than, oh, I'm not gonna have that pizza or I'm not, well, and I haven't been having pizza or nachos or anything anyways, really, since I've been on Weight Watchers. So I don't know. Everybody, all my friends here, they've been super supportive. Thank you. So last night's confessions. Another reason why I'm out here doing this. <clears throat> I took the day off from Weight Watchers yesterday. I knew I would settle up at the end of the day, but I didn't want to be worried about it throughout the day. It's okay, Lulu, leave it. So, I had, I did have meat yesterday, I had carne asada some refried beans, some Mexican or Spanish rice, whatever you want to call it, and that was breakfast and, well no, breakfast, <laughs> breakfast was a pumpkin spice latte, let's be honest. Um, then, so that was lunch, dinner slash snack, drunk girl snack was two slices of pepperoni pizza regular from pizza hut would you stop don't bark at the dogs and um a piece of the pizza hut dessert cookie the chocolate chip cookie so l oh, and <laughs> three-fourths of a bottle of red wine that's where the drunk girl part comes in Nope, that dog. One smart point for the coffee. Okay, five smart points for breakfast, zero for the egg white, one for the, uh, there's probably not even one, but one for the tofuti cream cheese, 
and four for the Ezekiel bread. All right, guys, sorry for the, um, the lighting, but I wanted to address something and I wanted to do it in a calm manner because <laughs> I have filmed a couple that weren't so calm. Okay, so it was commented that I don't smile enough in my videos and that I seem mad or sad. Okay, <clears throat> let's just talk about this. I did not get up to 400 pounds by being the most perfectly happy person in the world. I struggled with depression. Um, and my weight gain really took off when I had my oldest son. He is still handicapped and it's still, it's going downhill with his health, with his behavior, um, doctors, and everything. I mean, it just is. When I come on here, I am stealing moments for myself, really honestly, and hoping, you know, people don't come in and, um, you know, interrupt the video that I'm trying to make, which happens often and I often have to refilm something five times. So yeah, sometimes I'm not smiling and I feel stressed out. I have four kids, six, 14, 15, and almost 17. It's stressful. And, um, yeah, I mean, there's other dynamics in my life that I don't talk about. I just choose not to because I don't want to be beat up about them. But I'm sorry if I don't. Well, and I'm not even really sorry. It's just how I am. I'm a naturally sarcastic person. Um, I am a little intimidated being in front of a camera because I generally don't get in pictures or... Um, other things because I just didn't like the way I look. I mean, I'm getting better about it because I'm losing weight, but comments saying that I don't smile enough and I seem mad and sad. I'm sorry. I cannot help how I feel because sometimes, yes, sometimes I am sad. Sometimes I am mad. I mean, who isn't? I have never proclaimed to be, to be perfect without imperfection and I never will. I will work on smiling more. I just, it's just weird for me to see myself on camera and sometimes I don't feel like I have the best smile or I, you know, and I just, it's a confidence thing, people. I, <laughs> why I'm explaining myself, I don't even know. But I just want you to know it's not because I'm always mad or sad or anything. And again, somebody doesn't get up to 400 pounds, or at least I didn't, by being perfectly happy. And then I also didn't get down to 155 pounds and then go back up 100 pounds because I was perfectly happy. It was the exact opposite. Is I got so depressed that I didn't want to do anything except for eat because I am a stress eater. And comments requesting that I smile more because I seem mad or sad are not helpful for me. And I'm sure I might get some hate for this, but I got hate for being just, and I don't even think it was hate, it was just a criticism that didn't need to be made. And I did, I got that by just being myself, which is what I have always been. I have never hidden who I am on my channel. There's been many times that I didn't want to post something because I thought it would be looked on negatively, but I am who I am. This is my journey. This is my channel. I'm not going to change who I am unless it's positively if I can, and I am trying my very best. On that note, I will insert a picture of what I had for lunch because I wasn't even going to post a video because I let comments get to my 
get to me and I shouldn't do that. I just shouldn't. It's stupid. Because again, I let you guys into a little piece of my life and you guys don't know my full past. You don't know my full future. You don't know what's going on in that moment. So please don't be so judgmental. There's no need for it. None of us need that. If you want to be helpful, be helpful, but that is not being helpful. So anyways, that being said, lunch, I had a falafel, um, four little tiny falafel balls and a half of a pita, a little thing of hummus, cucumbers, and tomatoes. Pita was two, falafel was, I think I said three, and the hummus was five. So I think that's 10 smart points, and I had five or six before that, six before that, so it's 16, so I have 14 left for the day. I will show you what I have for dinner. Talk to you guys later. I also forgot I had this little bit of watermelon. There's still that there, but I had that little piece, or the, it's actually like three pieces, but those were my watermelon pieces. One smart point worth of coffee with three tablespoons of the sugar-free pumpkin spice and like a fourth of a cup, probably not even that, of the vanilla unsweetened cashew milk. All right guys, so quick change of plans. Um, my mom called and asked me if I wanted to go out to dinner and although I was drinking coffee, um, I said, hey, let's go watch a movie because we both wanted to see that movie, um, The Girl on the Train something about that something about a girl on train <laughs> and I was actually watching the um, trailer when she called so she is up for it so we are going to go catch a movie um, and we might go grab some food I don't know what if I get something I will show you what I'm getting I am wearing my new shirt I love it I did mean to grab my my hoodie though because I usually get really cold in movie theaters but that is the plan for tonight. So, I'm gonna go watch a movie and then go home, go to bed, and then go to work. So, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.